Today's question, how much rest should I take between workout sets? Um, that is actually a great question and it all depends on your fitness level. If you are starting out brand new to weight training and you've never done anything like it before, you can do a set of squats, 10 reps, and in 30 seconds, you're good to go again, straight away and able to do 10 reps. Now, as you get stronger, your rest times will need to increase. And recent uh, studies have shown that you can actually rest up to, if you're doing hypertrophy training, uh, you know, building muscle, you can rest up to three minutes and still get a hypertroph hypertrophic response. So before the general guide used to be 60, 90 seconds and you're on the set, but now you can rest up to three minutes. And the idea is that you want to rest so enough that your heart rate is back down, that your muscles have recovered, that you've mentally recovered, so that you can actually do the exercise with good technique and intent again. So for some people who are very cardiovascularly fit, they will be able to recover, recover between sets faster than someone who might not be as cardiovascularly fit. Similarly, someone who is super strong and lifting very heavy weights will take longer to recover because it, they're exerting a lot more energy. So as a rule of thumb, if you're a beginner, generally between sets, 60 to 90 seconds is loads of time. As you get stronger and more proficient, and if you're doing hyper, hypertrophy training, bodybuilding basically, you want to rest anywhere from 60 seconds to three minutes between sets to fully recover your muscles nearly so that you can do another set with good intent. If you're strength tra training and you're doing heavy weights of sets of one rep, two reps, three reps, four reps, five reps, so one to five reps, you might need anywhere from two minutes, three minutes, five minutes, somewhere even up to eight minutes to recover between sets because they're just so physically demanding on not only your body, but on your mind to get ready for those sets. So they're the kind of times you're resting. Now, if you're doing high intensity training, you want to keep the rest very long, very, very long because you want, because the key is high intensity. So think sprinting. If you were sprinting flat out for uh, 10 seconds, you would rest for a long time to fully recover for sprint training. If you're doing interval training, then you would middle, middle of the road the rest, you probably do one work, one rest ratio to change that. But that's aerobic training rest periods then. So when it comes to the gym, if you're training for strength, anywhere from one minute all the way to eight minutes, depending on your strength levels. If you're training for hypertrophy, generally 60 seconds to three minutes is perfect. And if you're a brand new beginner, just always give yourself 60 to 90 seconds of rest just to be sure that you are recovered and you should be good to go again. All right, guys, if you have any questions, you can ask in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Hope you have a good day and we'll talk to you later. Cheers.